this will be our chance, to lock it in. And the black bandit, Tim Gittemar, leads him out in car 68. Steve Allison out of Oklahoma at 23. Paul Rowland in 13. Followers, Mike Goldberry in 07. Tim Swergen out of Springfield in 14. And Rapid Roy Chisholm supporting the Homestead Boxer Foods, car number 57. Evidently got one car not making the car, and lights are going to be shutting off for the first 10 lap late model qualifier. And Tim Gittemeyer back with us out of St. Charles, Missouri. So here's outside from down in Brooklyn, Air, Oklahoma, the 23 machine of Steve Allison. Your third row has Lockwood, Missouri's Paul Wallen at 13, while ball of the late model rookie show for Mike Goldberry in 07. Rapid Roy along with Swearingen. Here they come. Quickly picking up the pace and Freestyle. Get him out of Texas. He'll look at all that. Here comes Wallen on the inside. Down by the wild side. They hit it. Wallen looks to the inside. Get him out on the outside. The bandit's got that familiar high four turn groove. Get him out of looking strong. Goes very back in third. Allison now running forward. Now on the back stretch ahead. Wallace Monte Carlo runs that inside groove once more. Not the place to try it as the bandit is excellent on that high side. Goldberry's on the charge now and hit McCarthy for grilling Monte Carlo. Now on the last stretch ahead now. It's still Gillemire in front. Rolling on his bumper. Goldberry hanging on to third. Gillemire. Rolling looking for running room. Will no will knows the tail. Goldberry has to back off the throttle for a moment. Now Rolling tries the inside to climb in the corner once more. Now on the front stretch they come with Gillemire still in control. Rolling in now, Goldberry coming up strong. Now on the back stretch, Rollin tries to get it back in the smoke front of the corner. Here comes Gittemar on the high side. Goldberry now, what's that inside lane also? Rollin drifts up high. Here comes the bandit down low. Side by side now. It's Rollin and Gittemar. Rollin now in control, but here comes Gittemar. Off that number four turn. We've now got six down. Goldberry trying the inside. Tim and Gittemeyer touch off turn one and two. As we get six down, four remaining in the first late model heat race. Lights are going to be shutting off. Single file and nose to tail. Leo has that green rolled up in his hand. back and forth, trying to keep those tires clean so he gets a good bite on this restart. Rapid Roy Chisholm right there looking in the shadows. And Tim Swearingen, who's been running all so strong this season in car 14, looking back at third. Young Steve Elson right there. Here they come. And oh, no, no, no. Well, let's try that one more time. Wall on your pace hitter, Chisholm right there with him. Then it's Swearingen. Everybody anxious here in that first late model heat of the evening. Back gives the signal to remember we're going back to Green Flag race and action. Now Wallen, about the time down in turn three, he'll start accelerating hard. Here they come now, nose to tail, look at us for the restart, and Freestyle! Swearinger dies to the inside of Roy Chisholm, now the battle for the number two and three spot. Meanwhile, Allison and Gittemeyer fighting it out back in the back. Meanwhile, up front, Paul Wallen all by himself now, as Chisholm and Swearinger continue their battle. Swears you go to the inside. Roy shuts the door and get him out of Goldberry now on the charge from the back. Off turns number four. Rolling with about an eight car late lead in that 13, Monte Carlo. Ross Swearingen and Chisholm continue a hard race. Get him out of Goldberry now. Once again, trying to find running room. The white flag coming out this time around for Paul Rollins. And he's only got one more left. 